One of the most prominent statues at the Illinois Capitol could soon come down. Speaker Michael, Michael Madigan calling it and a portrait symbols of hate. Our Capitol Bureau Chief Mark Maxwell is live at the State House near that statue of Stephen Douglas with the latest. Now, Mark, the Speaker says he wants to move on this quickly. Jennifer, that's right. The national discussion, the debate over race and history is now coming to Abraham Lincoln's hometown, where for more than a century, a statue of his most noted rival, his a debate opponent, uh, U.S. Senator Stephen Douglas, has stood here in this place of prominence just behind me. That could change in the days and weeks to come. After months of protests for racial justice, including some of those protests right here on these grounds, Speaker Madigan said he reviewed the history, he read back over some of Douglas's disturbing past as a slave owner in Mississippi, and his abhorrent words toward people of color. Now Madigan hopes to remove the statue of Douglas and promote the statue across the street of Dr. Martin Luther King Jr., putting that statue in a place of more public prominence. Madigan also is moving to immediately cover up a portrait of Douglas that hangs inside the House chamber. When lawmakers return in November, he wants them to vote to replace that painting with one of President Barack Obama. He said, quote, memorializing people and a time that allowed slavery and fostered bigotry and oppression has no place in the Illinois House. Now, the Office of the Architect and the Board of the Office of the Architect has to vote before any of these changes can happen. Speaker Madigan is asking them to do that, also saying, quote, of course, removing these images does not erase our history, responding there to critics of his, but it is one more step in acknowledging the suffering of so many and committing to create, uh, creating a better Illinois for everyone. And Jennifer, just moments ago, Illinois Senate President Don Harmon also agreeing that Stephen Douglas, a statue of his, has no place here. There's also one inside the State House on the second floor, and just next to it, a portrait of another American slave owner, George Washington. That debate soon to take place in Illinois. All right, Mark, thank you so much.